kiss him when he coming. He made more money last year than Mr. Drummond. So today's video is going to be a favorites video. I haven't done one of these in so long. Um, I actually don't remember when I last did one. Yeah, I don't remember. So we're going to do one today. I have quite a few things to show you guys. And yeah, so let's go ahead and get on with today's video. Okay, so the first thing that I have is food. Because, you know, why not? Um, and they are the Lay's Oven Baked Original. Um... 80% less fat than regular chips. That's, that's fucking awesome. Um, lately, I've been changing up my whole, like, diet thing. Like, you know, eating things like this. Drinking lots and lots of water. Just trying to, you know, get the weight down. And these are fucking amazing. Like, I love them so much. And I need to go get another bag. Because they're fucking amazing. Are they listening to Katy Perry? I don't like that bitch. The next few things I have are makeup products, um, are beauty products. Um, the first one is my uh, Real Tech Mink Sponge. Um, this is dirty. I need to wash it, but it just has makeup all over it. Um, if you guys don't know, I do wear makeup for my videos. Um, you know, I just try to even everything out, you know, look all okay. And um, this thing is amazing. This shit is only seven bucks at Ulta. And it's it's a lifesaver. It's fucking just you can do everything with this. You can use powders with this, everything. And um, a lot of people go and buy the beauty blender, which is like thirty fucking dollars or so I've heard. And I'm just like, girl, go to Ulta, buy this, and you will be saved. Okay, you will be saved. And then the next thing is an Elf product, and is the tone correcting powder. I saw this at Walmart, and I was just like, you know what? I'm gonna try this. Um, this is pretty much what it looks like. You guys see yourself? Look it, you guys can see yourselves. Ooh. Um, it's got these four tones. I use the green one a lot because I have a lot of redness on my face. But this works really, really well and it has like a matte finish and I really, really like it. It's good, it works. I would recommend it. It's only like three fucking dollars. The next thing is also was like three bucks and it's from e.l.f. and it's called Eye Refresh. I don't know if you guys can see that. But um, you roll the cap off and it looks like this and it's a little metal ball. And what you do is you roll it underneath your eyes or around your eyes or wherever. And you don't get it so close to your eye that you burn your eyeball. But um, this has like eucalyptus and stuff in there. And what it does is it kind of wakes you up, makes you look like you're alive. And um, like um, deep puffs like your eyes from when you like you wake up in the morning. You gotta go to work or you, you gotta make videos like me. Um, but... Yeah, it works really, really well. And the next thing is um, EOS Lip Balm. Everybody is always praising the fuck out of this. But lately I've been hearing... Mmm, smells amazing. Um, I forgot what this is. I think it's like Mandarin or something. I've been hearing a lot of bad things about it. Like, your lips get chapped afterward. And then you gotta keep using it. Otherwise your lips will get worse. And um, that hasn't happened to me yet. But I'm, I'm, I'm hoping that doesn't happen. Because I really like this. And it smells really good. The next couple things I have are, um, I guess body products. Um, the first thing is this Killer Queen miniature perfume. My friend bought this for me for my birthday and um, I've been using it so much lately. I think you guys can tell. It's almost gone. And this is like my favorite perfume. I love this shit so much and it's very like unisex. Like a guy or a girl could wear this. It has like, it doesn't smell like a girl, and it doesn't smell like a guy. It's just, it smells like both. Like, it's it's really good. I love it. I really like this one. And then the next thing is, I thought that this was body spray. And it's the Axe White Label Night. I think it's called Night. And it says, Confidently Fresh for 48 Hours Dry Spray Antiperspirant. I did not know that it was antiperspirant. And you just spray it under, and it stays all fucking day. And you ain't got a refresh. You ain't got a nothing. So, that's good. I like that very much. So, yeah, if you're a dude or a chick and you like this stuff, I'll recommend it. And the next thing is my phone right here. Um, I've been talking about it on Twitter lately. This is also one of my favorites. I've, when I first got it, I was like, this thing is too fucking big. Like, it's 
fucking huge. Can you guys see this? Um, it's a ZTE from Cricut because I do not have an iPhone and I do not want an iPhone. Um, I've just heard very, very, very bad things about the iPhones. And I, I just don't want it. And I have the, my background is like the Beauty and the Beast um, glass window thing. I think I like it. It's really cute. Um, but I love this thing so much. And what I've been watching a lot on here is Netflix. Like a motherfucker. And also, we're going into another favorite of mine. Um, and it has really good like sound and like when I have my headphones in it's like it's it's amazing I've been watching forensic files on here and I've also um, what else have I been watching uh, let's see I've been watching um, Bob's Burgers like I thought I, I thought I would give it a try and it's actually pretty fucking funny like I really like it and I've been watching Broadchurch on here. Um, I already did. I watched Broadchurch and then I watched the second series to it, which is fucking amazing. Like, if you haven't watched it, you need to do not watch Grace Point. It's the American remake of it and it's a fuck up. Broadchurch is the shit. It's fucking David Tennant is absolutely amazing. And it's it's fucking awesome. Like go on Netflix if you have it and watch Broadchurch. You will not be disappointed. I can guarantee you that shit. It's fucking amazing. It's a murder mystery show, and it's it's fucking awesome. I love it so much. Um, and also, I've been watching Parks and Fucking Rec. Yes, I'm already. Um, I've done with all six seasons. I didn't want to be. I was like taking my time with it because I love this show so much, and it just like it. It, it means a lot to me. For some reason, this show has got me. I don't know what it is, but I've been watching it for two months now, and I, I'm in love with it. I'm on the seventh season right now, I'm on episode two, and there's only 13 episodes, which I don't fucking like, um, but I'm gonna try to take my time with it. I'm gonna try to take my time with it. But yeah, so that is it for today. I will see you guys next time with another video. Until then, go read something awesome. Let me know a couple of your favorites this month. All right, bye.